Thanks for watching the fumble. Dwayne Wade, there are no words. All I can do is show you what the Kings had to deal with in their game against the Bulls Monday night. Take a look. Davis, clear it out. Let him go one-on-one on, one on the list. Exactly. Oh, what a move by Dwayne Wade. That is vintage D. Wade. And again, because once is just not enough. Right? The Hall of Fame behavior continued throughout the entire game. In the final seconds, the Bulls and Kings were tied 107 to 107. But don't worry, D-Wade to the rescue. He hit him with the good old jumper. Wow. 109-107. And to add insult to injury, a steal and seamless dunk moments later. Oh my goodness gracious, how does that happen? Oh! As you can imagine, tensions were high, which uh, never does favors for DeMarcus Cousins, Matt Barnes, or Rajon Rondo, who were all the center of a fight. Rondo was yelling, Boogie and Matt were shoving the Bulls' assistant coach. Ugh, it was a mess. Some pushing and shoving. Look at Rondo. Rajon Rondo going, oh, and Cousins just pushed the assistant coach of the Bulls. Boogie drew his second tech of the night and was ejected with just 1.1 seconds left in the game. Guys, this is his 16th technical foul of the season, which means he's automatically suspended one game and will miss playing against the Celtics on Wednesday night. D. Wade finished the game with 31 points, 6 rebounds, and 3 dimes, and DeMarcus Cousins threw up 18 points, 14 rebounds, and 5 dimes. But the Bulls beat the Kings 112 to 107, thanks to D. Wade. They've advanced to 26 and 26, while the Kings have dropped to 20 and 32. For all the best game highlights, subscribe before you go. Click that Fumble logo right there, tap the bell so you don't miss any news, and I'll see you soon.